Hey everybody, I'm just showing you um, a few of the bowls I've made, the mini bowls, and I've used um, Sculpey Air Dry Clay. It's $6.99 for two pounds at Walmart, and it works great for um, little bowls just like these. It's very sturdy and it dries very hard and nice with a smooth finish. Um, here's a few that I've made for the auction I'll be in uh, in a few weeks. And now I'm just going to show you how I begin decorating. Some of them I leave plain, but I'm going to decorate some of them, some of them with um, paint pen. So I paint sometimes a couple colors on the bottom so you can see a little bit of color coming through. So I did orange underneath here and then yellow. And the inside I did red and then just a little design on the outside. And then I sprayed them with clear, um, clear varnish, about four or five coats letting each one dry a few hours in between. And it's a really nice, very firm finish. Great for doodling on. So I'm just gonna use my Posca white pen. And I'm just gonna do um, a little bit of a messy mandala. I hope you can see it good. I know the shadows maybe or oh there that's better and I just start like this and I just add some lines some dots some dashes um, you could do anything inside your bowl though you don't have to do like a mandala you could do any kind of flowers or geometric any kind of design you like it's really very nice drawing on this finish because it's so smooth. And, um, you know, you don't want to start drawing on it too soon. I would let it dry a few days after you put all your coats on of uh, varnish because you just want to make sure it's totally dry. They call it cured. They say these are cured in 30 days, so... Um, that means totally hard and ready to... Um, utilize not the clay that's the varnish that I use I'm just doing a very simple pattern here it's a little bit hard to get it in the right light so you can see there you go and I'm just going to continue going around And doing little designs. I've also painted these in an abstract abstract style. I've done flowers um, with some of these that you see here. I'm just adding um, glitter. And that's it. I kind of like it just like that. I may do something around the edge. Maybe like little dots or something. Yeah, I think I'll do that. I think when you do the edge, it gives a nice three-dimensional effect. But for the others, I've been using glitter around the edge. And I really like that. Glitter and gold leaf. And I think I did one with silver, too which I really like. I like silver better than gold. But anyway, so then now I'm going to let that dry. And I am going to spray it again with a few coats of varnish. And then this one will be done. And that's it. Thanks, everybody. Bye-bye.